Start of the 92nd Bro Drill Cup is gonna be none other than Daru Ino versus Galader. So Galader, who is a Filipino individual who comes, well, who lives currently in Guam, so definitely looking forward to see how this is going to span, pan out. Immediately, first uh, offense from Galader already uh, made it so that Daru was forced to pop the burst. That being said, Daru answered in due fashion and found the uh, well, I found the successful offense already. Gonna get the wall break with the positive bonus. Thank you very much for the follow, Hokai Stai Gai San, and uh, welcome to the Bro Dogs. And here we go. This should be enough to kill. Yes, it definitely is. Here we go with the wall break. First round goes to Daru Ino. Daru Ino definitely familiar with the Biken matchup, uh, especially since he grinds it a lot against none other than Nino Mai, who is a very, very strong uh, Biken player. And he's been eating like Biken left and right. He definitely knows the matchup very well. A uh, matchup that's not so easy for Eno, not to be biased completely, because I do main Eno, <laughs> so I'm definitely biased. But uh, yeah, definitely not a matchup that's very, very easy for Eno, because Eno works a lot around uh, safe jumps. And uh, Biken just doesn't care at all about safe jumps because of the Hiragi. So it's actually pretty hard for Ino to... Well, Ino basically has to change her entire game plan uh, when she's playing against Biken because none of her setups really work against Biken because of the save jumps. But uh, that being said, you know, it, it, I, I feel like with the new buffs of, of Ino, spe specifically the, um, the Agitado, definitely makes things a lot easier to keep the pressure because it's very hard to time the Hiragi on a agitado, especially when the agitado is just thrown around randomly. So it can definitely throw off the timing of um, Biken players, in my opinion. So yeah, I feel like the matchup became a little bit easier, probably, yeah, more even-ish. But that being said, as you can see already, Daruno does not seem to have a lot of issues right now. Then again, he is the strongest Eno currently, not only on rating update, but also uh, tournament-wise, the, the Eno with the most uh, time spent playing Eno, not only on Strive, but also on uh, Rift 2 on x -Erd. so extremely strong Eno player, the best one in the world currently. So it's definitely going to be a uh, uphill battle, specifically for Alidor, who's probably not used to playing against an Eno of this caliber. And yeah, as you can see, this is probably going to be death. Yeah, this is death. Wow, didn't even need the uh, overdrive, by the way. Good stuff from the Arino gets uh, the... Uh, the first round of the second match, let's see if Galader can find any sort of answers. As for now, it's a little bit complicated. Gonna get hit by the uh, by the node, which really doesn't really matter whether you get hit by it or not, as long as you're forced to block it or you're forced to eat it. The reason be being that right after, you can be sure that Eno is gonna be following it up and forcing 50-50 uh, uh, mix-ups, or at least forcing their opponent down in order to force the, 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 the mix-up on them. So this is exactly working as intended. Poor Darino manages to take the second match as well. Let me give uh, get a quick look at the bracket right now just to see if everybody is doing okay, if there's no, you know, uh, unnecessary surprises. But things are looking pretty swell, not going to lie. Everything is going pretty good for now. Yep, I don't have any... I don't have any, uh, yeah, no issues. Like anyways, ah, very nice entire right there from Dar Should be able to get, yeah, some good damage right there. Very good use of the Agitado right there to keep the pressure. And to not only keep the pressure, but also get a guard break, which is extremely overwhelming. Very nicely done right there. The Kara cancel into the overdrive from Dar, you know, already on set point. Let's see if Alidor can make a miracle comeback as it is right now. It's definitely looking a little bit bleak, not gonna lie. That was very, very, very tight. That uh, combo right there almost dropped. And Alidor trying to read the, them hovers from Daru, you know, jumping with the jumping S. And you can see that now, da oh, and Daru going with the Megalomania, bro. No Megalo Daru, you know, the biggest lie. <laughs> but anyways. Uh, okay, you can see Darren. Oh lord! Try to bait the Hiragi, but yeah, man. Galader overwhelmed with that off. Kyoto, Jikai wa, eto, Aizu made, omachi kudasai ne, sugu hajime nai de kudasai ne. Next time, please do not start playing right away. Please wait for my signal. Thank you very much. Uh, eto ne. Let's see. <clears throat> One second. Here we go. I didn't have time to organize anything. 
here we go with the prediction as well that we made it and let me update the predictions here and here we go Cosimo versus Eto. okay good to go okay uh, for the time being I'm just gonna be checking something real quick I might be a little bit silent silent during that Okay, one second, guys. No, sorry. Okay, that should be okay. And first round is probably gonna go to Hoshino. Oh, yes, it does. With the wall break. Very nicely done. And a perfect at that, too. That was a pretty good. So this should be nice. Okay. Hopefully, it's gonna work this time. Suki Aki Bonsai, indeed. Funny matchup time, let's go, especially for... Well, it can really go either ways, but let's say that Chip has less the the luxury of of doing... Um, of failing to do or failing to confirm or making mistakes, yeah. He only has the right to do, like, one mistake, that's it. Or he's gonna die. <laughs> ah, here we go, first mistake. <laughs> okay, that's good. No, in the drop, second mistake. And this is going to cost him the match. <laughs> Are you serious? Wait, 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 okay, okay, Woo. it was in level 3, that was crazy, bro. Oh lord, the wake up, the wake up, oh good stuff from Eto, managed to bring it back though, nice stuff, if he doesn't drop it, very nicely done, that was so close though, not gonna lie, good stuff from Eto, manages to steal that first freaking match, man, that really could have went either way. But good stuff from uh, Ito, he managed to bring it back. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty pretty surprised. Good stuff. Okie dokie, Breads and Cookie. Here we go with the uh, second match. And very nice entire right there from Ito managed. Ah, almost got the wall break. Will get the wall break right there using the Fujiyama. Thank you. <laughs> oh, <Tutsuki>, come on. <laughs> good stuff from Ito. Gonna get the safe jump. There we go with the wild assault to keep the pressure going. Goes for the overhead. Quick Roman cancelled, and here we go with the... Oh, Lord! That was so genius from Eto using the uh, Roman cancel to not... To keep Hoshino in place and jump over him and the mine at the exact same time to just get rid of it. Very nicely done. Let's see if... Oh, and Eto with the aerial grab. Not enough to kill, but goes with the command grab for the follow-up and the kill. Very nicely done by Ito actually manages to uh, well to take it, yeah. I right, go the jump in. Oshino has got the coffin ready to smack some chip, but okay, let's see if Oshino can manage to get out of the corner. All he needs is one hit. This one opening. Is Ito going to give it to him though? And Ito with the relentless pressure right there. Look at this man. Oh uh, no! Oh no, and it's not even resorting to using the grab, but waiting for the effects of the um, of the deflect shield to wear out so that he can uh, so that he encounter him and get a, a full combo off of it. Very nicely done. Things are looking pretty swell for it. Too, not going to lie. Okay, let's see if uh, sweet old uh, Hoshino is going to be able to bring it back. We shall see. And here we go with the Ashimoto! And it's back! Yeah, you can see Eto trying to fish for that burst. But Hoshino just remaining very, very patient, not wanting to give it to him, and rightfully so. Very nice pacing from Eto, though, not gonna lie. Goes for the uh, tap dust into the Roman cancel to get the corner carry. Should be able to get the positive bonus from the wall break. Here we go with the wall break. It's safe time. Safe jump time. Oh, and the four combo right there from us. You know, goes with the mine. Gets the jump in. Careful with the wake up DP. Ito absolutely loves to use. Ooh, that was very. Oh, 
sword and you press a button at the absolute worst timing and you're dead. <laughs> Good stuff from Hoshino, not out of this yet and thankfully so. We are, uh, we have yet to be on set point anyway, so it's definitely not over for Hoshino. He has more opportunities. Oh, almost got the jump in, got the jump in right now. Gets the confirm, goes for the safe jump and gets the jump in again. Oh, and this is death. Bye bye. <laughs> Okay, Oshino not out of it at all. Very nicely done. Brings it back. Let's see if he can put one more on the table just to get things uh, a little bit tied down, you know, tied up. We shall see, we shall see. Imada! Let me check the bracket real quick, guys. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. Lucky, lucky. Alpha Brave. Okay, here we go. The wall break. This time around, Ito has the positive bonus. Oh, wow, man. The recovery on that jab, though. And it's back to no, no neutral zone. Okay, good stuff from Ito. Uh, oh, here we go with Ito, man. Using the Alpha Blade right after Yellow Room canceled to catch Hosino off guard. Hosino with the guards right there. Wake up, DP. Ito doesn't care anymore. Careful, no anti air. Probably was afraid of the aerial behemoth. Wow, that jab though, that jab though, man, godlike move. Uh, is it gonna be enough? No, it's not. It's not. Yeah, um, Gold Lewis is a big boy. Oh, and here we go the juggle. No, too far to get the follow up behemoth then gets jabbed to death. We are in set point. Let's see if Hoshino can bring it back again with the jab, bro, man. This has been working so good for it though. Was for the Suki, not the follow up though. Ooh, very nice grab and the instant the, um, the instant uh, block from uh, from Hoshino was really well done. Hoshino not giving his burst away, man. Chooses the absolute best moment possible to get that burst, man. That was so genius of Hoshino. And this could actually lend him the, the kill if he manages to open it up even once. Here you go with the double overhead, man. Oh no, he cornered himself. This is so unfortunate. This is so unfortunate. And it was gonna probably going to, yeah, he's definitely going to um to uh, benefit from a uh, positive bonus right there. No DP from it. Oh, it, oh, it oh, again with the jab. Ooh! Careful there. And here we go. Makes up time. Ooh, here we go. Ah, no, this is death. Yeah, this is over. Ah, uh, if he doesn't drop it, then he doesn't. And here we go. Eto takes it three to one, man. Eto on point. あ、大丈夫ですよ、ダルさん。どうぞ。始めてください。そうですね、基本、えっと、その配信のえ、あれですね。チャットの方に配信のアンナイがなければ倍そのままもう始めていいですよ。全然続けても全然えっと問題ない
Caffeine is on deck right now. Wants to apply the pressure as much as possible. Ooh, no 6P for you, sir. <laughs> you wanted to 6P me? Here you go. I'm gonna 6P you. And Caffeine, man, look at this, man. Almost got it. Goes for the Roman cancel. And gonna get the wall break into death. First snap goes to Caffeine, yo. And I know for a fact that Caffeine absolutely hates playing against Kome Kome. Not, not Kome Kome in general, but I don't think he likes the uh, the Asuka matchup. Uh, from what I saw on his posts on Twitter and whatnot, he definitely is not very fond of the Asuka matchup. And Kome Kome being one of the best Asuka in the business makes it so that Caffeine probably hates this matchup with a passion. <laughs> but that being said, as you can see, he's actually doing very good right now. Applifying all sorts of mix-ups and varying his offense and... You can see that Kome Kome is uh, looking a little bit too overwhelmed right now. And yeah, Caffeine on with the Illusion Driver. Gonna get the wall break and no... Wow! They didn't even need to get a follow-up. That was enough thanks to the fact that the shield from uh, Asuka actually had to... Thank you. No worries, Galader. Thank you very much for, um, for participating, bro. Yeah, there are a lot of very strong players in this tournament, bro. There are, but... You'll get there eventually as well, no worries, man. Thanks for participating. That being said, here we go with Kome Kome, man. It is the Cube Festival. And here we go with the Super Cube. Kome Kome gonna get the Hard Knockdown. Goes for the Fiery Cubes. The Electrical Cube, another set of Fiery Cubes. He goes for the Overhead Sphere. And Kome Kome does not want to use his Burst whatsoever. Gets grabbed. Caffeine definitely looking pretty good right now. Trying to go for a uh, side switch. And uh, thankfully for him, Kome Kome delayed a little bit his burst and made it so that Caffeine could not stay in the corner. Lock! And the overdrive. Oh! I thought that Kome Kome had committed to, uh, to an attack right there. Okay, okay. Damn, the roller coaster of emotions right now. I seriously thought that Kome Kome was going to get hit right, uh, right here. Here we go back to the cube. The cube salad. What is Kome Kome going to cook for us? We shall see. We're going with the, the wind cubes. We're playing freaking golden sun right there. Okay, and here we go with the tech from Kome Kome. Goes for the explosion. And he does not have any, any shield anymore. This, if he gets opened up right now, it could be very big. That being said, just a little bit more. And the opening has begun. But thankfully for him, he was able to get his shield uh, mid, uh, mid, um, mid combo, which uh, kind of uh, limited the amount of maximal damage that he could possibly receive. Thankfully for him. And here we go with the water cube. Another water cube. Air cubes. <laughs> Very nice use of the Roman cancel right there for um, Caffeine to go over the six feet of Kome Kome, which would have hit him if it uh, if he didn't use it. And Kome Kome again with the electrical cube, go for the water cube, the air cubes, goes for the aerial earthquake. This one hit is all that Kome Kome needs. Ooh, nice blocks. And Caffeine goes for the grab, but this time around, Kome Kome committed to taking. Let's see if he can. Oh man, if to seal the deal. Beautiful 6P. Gonna get the corner carry. Oh Lord, but he doesn't have any life anymore. He needs to be really careful. It's now or never. And it was now for Kome Kome. He managed to get the kill. Very nicely done. One. Uh oh, I think. I'm gonna check the replays. I'm gonna check real quick. I completely forgot. Let's see. Uh, it's 1-1 one, one for, yeah, 1-1 one, one for both. Okay, we're good. Here we go. <clears throat> good, good, good. Okie dokie, bread and cookie, and on to the third match. Let's see how this pans out. Very nice take again from Kumuki Madonna. Get a juggle using the electrical and the air cube. Again, the air cube is going to get the juggle. Should be able to get, yeah, the wall break couldn't quite use his tension bar, his overdrive, in order to get the uh, hard knocked out. Nice patience from Caffeine, not going for the 6 speed right away. Noticing that Kome Kome was going to go for uh, the Roman cancel in order not to get it tired. That was an oddly timed uh, 5HS from Caffeine. And here we go with Asuka, Kome Kome using the super cube. Air cube, triangle of death. And minion... 
Oh, nice juggle we're using the explosion for the wall bounce in the corner from Kome Kome. Very nicely done. Let's see how this spins up for Caffeine. Things are looking a little bit leak, not going to lie. No bursts. Uh, yeah, no possibility of getting out of this pressure. Yo, Zoom, how you doing, brother? Good evening, bro. And Kome Kome with the wall break. Uh, he has Caffeine exactly where he wants them. What is going to be uh, the plan for Caffeine to try to open Kome Kome up? Kome Kome, one of them. He has a very, very strong defense. As you can see, extremely hard to open them up. And he's very familiar with the uh, Jackal matchup as well. Like surgically aiming for each and every single uh, minion. Uh, but unfortunately for him, he is in Pressure Town. And again, man, Kome Kome with the anti airs right there. Get rid of the minions. Gonna use the uh, the big cube. And here we go with the overdrive. Is it gonna hit? Ah, too far. This is too unfortunate. Kome Kome with. Oh no, he drops it. You don't wanna drop it against Caffeine. <gasps> Caffeine with the shimmy. You would love to see it. Here we go with the juggle and the side switch. That was crazy. Ooh, is he gonna get it? He's gonna get it! Caffeine brings it back and all because Kome Kome dropped his killing move. He must be so angry right now. It All you need is one opportunity, man. One opportunity and you can bring it back. This is how Strife plays, guys. Never give up whatsoever. Never ever. Yarune! Yarune! Indeed. And here we go with the juggle from Kome Kome. Goes for the explosion. Oh, never drop on Caffeine, man. Never ever drop. Oh, you'll you'll live to regret it for sure. For sure, for sure. Oh, here we go with the DP from Kome Kome. Kome Kome struggling with his uh, mana level right there. Not going to lie. Ooh, that was close. A uh, very nice use of the jab right there to dispatch the. I forgot the name of the. Uh, Oh, sorry, I, <laughs> I just yawned. Uh, to dispatch the, uh, the the minion. Oh, again with the shimmy still gets it by the 2D and just like this, man. Caffeine bringing it back. All because of an unfortunate drop, man. Poor unfortunate drop from Kome Kome. That was so unfortunate from Kome Kome, man. The shimmy master, man, yeah. Yeah, Caffeine noticing that Kome was going a lot for the text whenever he tried and attempted to grab him. Yeah, Caffeine just said, okay, you want to take this? Well, you're going to eat my shimmy then. That is the conditioning that Caffeine has applied right there. Very nicely done. Okay, and here we go with the minion onslaught. As <laughs> you can see again, Caffeine trying to go for the shimmy this time around. Kome Kome not so quick to bite. And uh, thankfully so. God like 5HS, man. Good stuff from Caffeine. Managed to get the wall break. Hmm. And here we go with the Triangle of Death. Wow, Caffeine letting him uh, draw some uh, some cards right there. Oh, Lord. Kome Kome just needs one opening. Very nice 6P right there from Caffeine. Just like this Caffeine on match point, actually. Let's see if he's capable of sealing it out. That would probably be the first time that the Caffeine manages to to uh, defeat Kome Kome in tournament, which would be very, very cool for him. Things are looking pretty good for him, not going to lie. He's got the corner positioning, he's got the minion. Tried to go for the shimmy, goes for the tap dust, should be able to get the wall break, and he is. Very nicely done. Ah, Kome Kome is out of shield. This is the time to uh, bring in the heat. Ah, man. Dispatching two minions at once. This is unfortunate for him. And here we go with Caffeine. Popping that in that overdrive right in the middle of lock strings. And here we go with the pressure. What is it going to be to make? Ooh! Saved by the YRC, bro. What was that backdash? That was godlike. The backdash of ca Caffeine right on the Wild Assault from Kome Kome. But you can see, man, Kome Kome, the defense. The defense is there, man. He knows, he knows. Is Caffeine, Caffeine so desperate to get the opening. He just wants the opening. Just, just let me kill you, please. <laughs> you can hear it. Good Lord, oh my Lord. 
I'm, I'm, uh, I'm off for you a promotion to ban land, bro. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, here you go. Good boy. Anyways. Uh... So... I need to update my... My... Oh, good stuff! And here we go! Caffeine with the 3 to one Awesome match, I'm sure of it. And uh, definitely looking forward to it. Uh, that being said... Uh, just one second. Combination! Yo show. Uh, what do I want to do? Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna set up my bot so that. Uh, so that I don't get like these promotions again. You always need to update them regularly so that. Uh, what was it again? I forgot. Spam filter. Okay. Uh, how did you not recognize him? Okay. Oh, okay, very good. Sorry for the wait. We are back, baby. Sorry for the wait. So, uh, as we can see, yeah, Takami actually losing this first round. This is very, very surprising. But then again, it is Lucy Johnny. Shield minions. Oh my God, the real man. Jacko is a menace, bro. Especially in the um, in season three, I really think she's up there in the in the tier list. I am I am 100% sure that right now Jacko is top here. 100% sure. I already thought she was really strong in like season 2, but in season 3 I'm convinced that she stopped here. And nobody can tell me otherwise. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, I'd like to have like the input of a, another, like a Jackal player, like for example Carrot or whatnot. I'd like to know what he thinks about it. That being said, here we go with Utsui, Johnny and the kill! Lord, okay, I can see why Johnny might be a bad matchup for, um, for Axel. I can definitely understand why. So let's see if it's just, uh, you know, not just a fluke. Which I, I'm pretty sure it's not the case because Usi Johnny is a very strong player. That being said, Takarin is no slouch either. He knows how to uh, deal with very complicated situations. So let's see how this pans out. And here we go with the pressure from Axel. From Takarin, is he gonna find a way? Uh, unfortunately for him, he gets uh, clipped by the Miss Finer. Here we go, Miss Finer. Mix ups right there. Goes for the overhead. Again with the Miss Finer. Nice air to her right there from. <gasps> And Lucy Johnny with the bait of the burst. Big damage right there. Gonna get the heavy knockdown. Goes for the uh, for the safe jump and gets the kill. Very nicely done. So let's see how this spins out. And here we go with the grab from Lucy Johnny. And here we go with the Miss Finer. Nice bar right there from Takarin. Gonna get the knockdown. Goes for the uh, sickle storm. Tries to go for the grab. Nice tech from Lucy Johnny. Gets the. Uh, the counter hit right there on the two uh, HS, I believe it was. No, it wasn't. And here's Rigo with the air to air jumping S. Again with the jumping S. Again, trying to make his way in. Oh, and here we go with the overdrive. Unfortunately for him, Lucy Johnny was aware of what. Uh, Takani wanted to do right there, just resorted to blocking and punishing adequately. Couldn't quite get the the fight. Oh no! And the drop right there on the the world. This is so unfortunate for um, Takani and then uncharacteristic as well. Takani definitely keen on uh, wanting to win this one. Big miss finders right there. No air to air for no. Takani with the air to air gets the kill, man. The cojones on Takani to just jump up and uh, meet. We see Johnny in the air. That was really, really nicely done. Let's see how this spins out. Nice grab right there from Takarin. Gonna get the... Uh, gonna get... Oh, Lord! And the closest counter hit. Oh, he drops it again! What's going on with Takarin? This is so uncharacteristic of him. Oh, no! Too far to get the 2HS2 to, to connect. Uh, oh, Lord! The he has been baited. 
Oh, the double instant overhead. That was so freaking clutch. And Takani managed to block everything. Okay, nice recognition right there from Takani. Punishing the Miss Finder, the block Miss Finder. Unfortunately, no RC right there to cancel and to get the kill. Yeah, ooh, that was a big Miss Finder. Got this spins out. Oh, then Sengi Key, but ooh. Ah, uh, this is looking pretty bad. Nice of R from Takari manages to clutch it out right at the end. One, two, one. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see how this spins out. Good lord. That was so clutch. As expected from Takari, man. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's see if uh, Usiburi can bring it back. We shall see. <clears throat> and no one swam right there. Takari, yeah, really struggling to keep Usiburi on uh, the ground. Not going to lie. Uh, no entire right there. Uh, it's pretty hard to uh, re to um, to react on this one. Not going to lie. Here we go with the Lin Sengeki. He's gonna get the juggle and the follow up into the command grab. Nice entire from Takarin. Almost got it. Oh, nice punish. Well, light punish, but nice punish. Nevertheless. Get back in neutral. Oh, wow. That was so cool. Ooh! And the freaking shimmy, if you might call it. Nice Miss Finder and Usiburi with the overdrive for the kill. Yes, it is. Good stuff, good stuff. Let's see how this spins out. Definitely not over till it's over. And it's pressure time. Usiburi finding the opening. Trying to work on a wall break, but Takani not staying in place. Ooh, the cojones of Usiburi to just press button in the air, not afraid of getting in tired by Takari. Wow, what the hell was that? And here we go, the Miss Finer. Nice air to air from. Wow, Usi Johnny almost got the juggle. I don't know if he, he dropped it or this combo rat doesn't work or whatnot, but wow, the closest for the kill. Takari pressing buttons on Wake Up right there, and this definitely cost him this third match. Let's see if he can manage to make a comeback. Definitely does not want to go in the loser bracket already. Big Miss Finer right there. Corner carry again with the air to air. Takari not bursting right there. Deciding to keep it for after the wall break. And rightfully so. Ah, nice air to air again from Musei Johnny, man. Definitely on point. Tickle Storm. Again with the air to air, man. This has been the bane of Takari. No overdrive this time around. Ooh. Ah. Oh lord, rainwater for the rescue. He gonna get the side switch as well. This is looking pretty good for Takarin. Tried to go for the grab, man, but the see Johnny was aware of it already. Goes for the instant overhead using the Miss Finer. Good lord. Nice for. Uh -uh. Is this gonna be enough? No, it's not. Wow. And jumping as for the kill. Takari not out of this yet. Nice confirms from Takari and again gonna get air to her though. With a little slight drop right there from Musu Junior, unfortunately. Okay, Takari being a little bit more mindful in the aerial space than before. Does not want uh, Johnny to jump on him for obvious reasons. Nice confirms from Takani. Should be able to get the wall break, but Usi Johnny resorting to using the burst in order to deny it for him. It's very important for uh, players to get the positive bonus as quickly as possible. So for usually the first one who manages to get it is going to be in a huge advantage. Nice counter hit. This is going to be big for Usi Johnny. Even has the tension. Going to go for the overdrive. Orinonawa. Boom. Good stuff from Johnny, gonna get the hard knockdown. Goes for the grab for the kill. Very nicely done. Johnny on set point. Let's see if he can seal the deal. Get that in with the entires. Here we go with the chicks. But he doesn't want to see Johnny to jump on him, but Johnny being very persuasive right there. Kaboom! Gonna get the wall break.
Wow, and the infant over the, the, the tab does for the kill, and just like this, man. Johnny sending Takari to the water. I'll be right back. Okay, what the hell happened? Oh, I'm gonna say, <laughs> Donut. What happened? What happened? We had a connection error, apparently. Okay, hopefully this summer is gonna work. We're gonna see. So, caffeine versus Darwin. Hopefully, it's gonna work this summer. I had a lot of connection error today, which is very un uh, characteristic. Or maybe it is, actually. <laughs> I guess not get DQ'd. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, okay, we're good to go. Perfect. Strivers. Exactly. Okay, good good stuff, good stuff. We're back on track. Okay, an immediate, immediate burst from Caffeine does not want to deal with any sort of pressure from Darwin, rightfully so. Let's see how this spins out. Very big jump in right there from Daru. Should be able to get the wall break. Decides to keep his burst uh, gauge and just get a, a regular wall break. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna kill. Good stuff from Daru. Already with uh, the first round. Let's see if Caffeine can bring the heat. We shall see. Very nice use of the wild assault. Should be able to get the wall break. Decides to use uh, the remaining of his burst gauge in order to secure a uh, heavy knockdown there we go the pressure is real Ooh! oh no 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 good thing that it hit uh caffeine in the air because if it was not the case daru would have had a oh big big burst right there from daru and caffeine did not believe in it unfortunately for him good stuff uh, from Daru could not get the quick cancel. Very courageous 6P right there from Caffeine. Goes for the quick dust. Oh, got the OTG. And a grab for the kill. Caffeine not out of this yet by any means. Is he going to be able to seal the deal? We shall see. Ooh, big chemical love for Caffeine. Daru going low. Forcing the burst from Caffeine. Oh, no, 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 no. No minion for you, sir. <laughs> now we're just psycho bursting right through. Oh, Lord. And this should do. Good stuff from Daru. It's definitely not totally one-sided, but yeah. Daru having the edge right now. Caffeine definitely fighting an uphill battle. Let's see if he manages to seal the deal. Japanese drivers are hard at work practicing for our arc reveal this week. Oh, yes, they are, bro. They definitely are. We have a tournament tomorrow as well. We have, uh, and then yeah, like overall, everybody gonna be grinding all this week for sure. So yeah, definitely. Uh, I'm gonna go to Arc Rebel as well, and um, I can't wait to play against all of these very good players, man. It's gonna be awesome. And here we go, the wall break. No wall break for you though. Caffeine uh, struggling to get close to Dora right there. They're making good use of ah uh, yeah. Oh no. No gold burst for you, sir. A big 6P right there from Daru. Gonna get a full combo in the corner. Uses the all assault to secure the uh, the the, um, the heavy knockdown. So tomorrow it's uh, offline turn. Yeah, it's in the Red Bull. You know it's the Tatakai Tuesday organized by uh, by Giuna. So in Nakano. So it's gonna be at Red Bull Circle, whatever, whatever. And yeah, I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna participate to it. Hmm. It's tomorrow, it's gonna be streamed also on uh, Anime Illuminati, so on Giuna's uh, Twitch channel, basically. There's gonna be uh, Leo Faust as well. So the the big, the, the sponsored uh, Japanese uh, Faust player, called Leo, by the way, <laughs> which is confusing. Uh, so he's gonna be participating there as well. There's gonna be Karu, there's gonna be Haru, Haru, Haruki as well, the Jacko player. And uh, yeah, Gilgamesh is gonna be there. You're gonna have Zell, you're gonna have... Uh, yeah, you're gonna have uh, a lot of people actually tomorrow. Now I think about it. So yeah, definitely you should tune in. Thanks, bro. Thanks. 
I'm gonna do my best. Uh, that being said, look at that. Caffeine taking one round again, short of just one more to get a match so that he can get the tie. Very nice with punish from Caffeine. Goes for the big cross. A big six spear right there from Naru. Should be able to secure a wall break. Yes, he is. And back to the game. Ooh, no minion for you, sir. Big counter it this is gonna do a lot of damage not gonna kill by any means daru wanting to use his wild assault to secure oh uh, yeah good oh <gasps> that was so intelligent by caffeine to not press any button right there oh gonna get the fake cross up oh nice grab sort of one mix oh i thought it was gonna hit him careful ah caffeine getting hit all the time but this woo, woo. oh good lord Careful there! One more hit, this is all you need. All you need is love, bro. Yeah, Caffeine wants to get it and gets it! The jump in from Caffeine, taking one off of the Master Daru Eno, man. Good stuff from Caffeine! Holy freaking lord! Can Caffeine make it happen? That would be sick, man. Caffeine the God Killer. Seriously, Caffeine has been... Um, has actually won against a lot of very strong opponents in previous iterations of the Brojo Cup. Yeah, man, Caffeine is always, he's like the underdog, but he has won against a lot of very, very strong players. And look at that! That blue Roman got somebody, here we go with that Roman! Woo! No sorry! Too far to get the kill, though. Here we go with the Wild Assault. Daru just holding it in. Oh, Daru with the bar, it finds the opening. Ooh, big hit, 5 inches, and Caffeine getting the kill with the close S. Damn, Caffeine drank a little bit too much coffee today, man the hell good lord good stuff for him okay very nice throw of uh, the minion Ooh. oh okay good stuff from caffeine gets the jump in he could have got the bait on the birds though but he didn't believe in himself believe in yourself believing in yourself bro come on Ooh. and the big duty counter it careful there this is gonna do a lot of damage no wild assault right there uh no gate for it but that being said, one hit away from getting the kill. No. Oh, big five inches. Oh, and again, the same pattern as in the last freaking match. The uh, deflect shield into the standing HS. Into Roman cancel for the kill. Yo. Caffeine up two to one, taking the lead. Oh, the big shield again, man. Ooh, but no stroke for you, sir. I'm gonna stroke you. Ooh, Lord. Yeah, and finally, Darino finding the opening. Gonna go low. Gonna get the wall break. Darino has had enough with all of this. All of these minionries. Ah, and here we go. The fake. Uh, the fake low. Good stuff from Daru. Takes the, <laughs> takes the, the first round of this fourth match extremely convincingly. And here we go with the chemical love. Darino with the corner. Pressure already installed. Should be able to get the wall break. Yes, he is. And look at the damage, by the way. Yo, this is crazy. Ah, big 2D counter hit. Oh, Lord, and the patience from Caffeine, man. That was sick. Goes for the cross up. Oh, no, not like this. Daru knowing that Caffeine was gonna wake up with the gold burst. Not enough to kill, though. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Here we go with uh, the pressure. Nice grab from Caffeine. Is he gonna make a comeback again? Nice grab again from Caffeine. Big YRC and it's, yeah, it's mixed up time. If you block the YRC, you are forced into a 50-50 against Eno. Isn't that pleasant? <laughs> Anyways, on to the last match, man. It went down to the wire. Is Caffeine going to be able to uh, to defeat that behemoth that Darwin is. We shall see. Too far for the ticket to connect. Big 2D again, man, with the chemical love this time around. Caffeine. Ooh, finding the opening. Gets the grab. Goes for the tab dust. And going to benefit from the positive bonus. No, and jumping it is. Darwin with the corner carry combo. Uh, too far. Ooh, no, 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 no. What? Oh, okay, good stuff from Caffeine. He did have uh, an additional bar. Oh, <laughs> uh, Lord. Good patience from Daru. Goes low. Good Lord. 
Yeah, don't jump. Ah, nice XP right there from Caffeine. He was really close to get hit. Okay, and it's minion time. Ah, uh, Caffeine trying to fish for a shimmy, man. Ooh, the 6P again. Oh, Lord. And Caffeine with the bait goes for the OTG. Nice block on the wire. See Caffeine on game point. Is he going to be able to send our in the losers? That would be so sick. That would be so sick, yo. Oh, Caffeine is in. Caffeine is in good for the low. Goes for the low again. And it's a block time. Hello, this is my fiesta. Oh, and Lord, look at the damage. Goes for the tap. Does, but man, ooh, Daru. Ooh, got the anti-air as well. Daru's life hanging by a thread. What is going to happen? We shall see. Ah, uh, Daru having problems getting in, bro. Okay, here we go. Oh, and the tap dust! Is it gonna be enough? We shall see. Ah, uh, no, he drops it. He drops it. Oh, the stroke. Stroke me. Stroke me sideways. Careful, don't drop. No, that was so... Careful. Don't get open. No, and Daru with the empty low. Is he gonna... Ah, uh, this is bad. Uh, okay, he's gonna get the... Okay, it's fine. Still one more chance. One more chance. Oh, and the kill the two D cafe since Daru and the losers. And that being said, we are moving on to the next battle. It's gonna be none other than Usui Johnny versus Amato. Amato, the um, how do you call it? Uh, the uh, the pupil of none other than Leo Faust. So very strong Leo player. And Amato will definitely no slouch either. Very strong one as well. That was a pretty intense set, man. I'm gonna love editing that shit, man, and put it in on YouTube. That was really good stuff. I definitely, I, I, I knew that Caffeine had it in him, but I didn't know whether he was going to pull it today. But yeah, good stuff, man. Good stuff from Caffeine. It's definitely not over, though. Uh, Daru is going to come back. I, I, I guarantee you guys. I can guarantee you guys right now that Daru went straight in uh, the, the Celestial, uh, the Celestial, how do you call it? On the, the Celestial field floor, and he's looking for every single Jackal he can find. I can guarantee you, man. <laughs> Good, uh, that's too bad, cow. That's too bad. <laughs> you should have, you should have bet on the, uh, you should have bet on the uh, on caffeine, bro. But but it is what it is. It's fine, it's fine. You know, points you get some, you lose some. It's not over. That being said, look at that. And Amato trying to f work his way for the first round and manages to do so. Very nicely done by Amato. The Johnny down one round. Definitely not over. Wow, nice juggle. That is sick. Good stuff from Musi Johnny. Gonna get the wall break. And a big 2S counter hit right there. To be able to get the wall break. Yes, he does. Straight into the... What's my name? What do you know Noah? Boom. Get out of here. Good stuff from Musi Johnny. Gonna go for the jump in. Gonna get the juggle straight. Oh, no. He drops this super. You hate to see it. And Amato is gonna use this opportunity to... Teleport and get out of the corner and the double. The double missed finder for the kill. Not over till it's over. One more round. The one who takes this one takes the first map. Nice far HS right there. Far HS which comes out extremely quick. Let's see how this spins out. Big miss finder right there. And the jump out of Usi Johnny, even though he was harassed by many fouls. And the Mamato. If at first you don't succeed, just go ahead and make my head an afro again and wow okay that, that was fun that was interesting good stuff from amato amato still in the corner goes again for the afro man good stuff from amato goes again for the afro are you serious are you serious that was sick good stuff from amato takes the first round in a very very interesting fashion not going to lie damn man good stuff from amato let's see how this spins out and uh, we are on to the next battle. Let's see if uh, Usui Johnny can manage to bring it back. Little Faust is out. He wants to play. And play you will. Nice juggle. Almost got the juggle. That would have been sick. Nice reaction uh, from uh, Johnny to realize that Amato is going to fall right in front of him. And does the grab. Here we go, we'll see Johnny getting that hard knockdown, wanting that corner positioning. Big, big dive right there from Amato. Having a huge corner carry. Oh, tried to go for the afro again, man. But this time around, we'll see Johnny said, nope. 
You already gave me that haircut last time. I don't like it. Oh, wow. What the hell happened? The street. Woo! What the hell is going on? What are you doing, guys? And the big follow-up right there from Usujin. He gets the kill. Let's see how this spins out. Mr. Fina. Big Miss Fina. Ooh, and I'm out of pressing buttons. Does not want to be cornered whatsoever. Oh lord, the bar is real. So Johnny really trying his best to get out of the corner. Oh, goes for the fake miss fighter into the grab. Ooh la la, big jumping. Big jump, the jump out from Amato got uh, scooped by the uh, the miss fighter though. Okay, and here we go. The Roman cancel into the miss fighter. So double overhead right there. Oh no, Sherry, I told you I hate your haircut. And let's see, Johnny brings it back. One to one. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Looking pretty good, not gonna lie. Let me check the bracket real quick, guys. Let's be sure that everything is going swell, and it is. We have our top eight. So the top eight will be Darino, Caffeine, Usi, Johnny, Amato, Eto, Takarin, uh, and Kome Kome versus Hagiara. Yeah. So this is our top eight, basically. That is good stuff. Definitely looking. Only good players, man. Only good players, of course. No, there's only good players you will participate to the Bro Joke Up, anyways. And it was oh big to S counter it. Oh, I almost got the juggle. That would have been sick. Here we go with the Roman cancel from Amato. Went for the follow up spear. And Amato, ooh, gonna get the trumpet. Uh, he was a little bit too far, but it's fine. Should be able to get the killer. Nevertheless, he does with the mix, mix, mix. Good stuff from Amato. And on to the next battle. Ah, there goes the jump in. Oh wow, the big 6P from a very late 6P by Amato. But it worked nevertheless, so it's fine. It's fine. Nope. Amato checking the uh, dashes right there from Usujani. Goes straight into the overdrive. What's his face? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I actually never saw it. That's very funny. Oh, here we go with Amato and the mix up. Tried to go for an MC low, but Usu Johnny was aware and didn't get hit by it. Big close up pressure from Amato. Gonna go for the low. Mix, mix, mix again with the mix. Too far to get the last hit in, though. That was so unfortunate. Woo! And the cross-up, man! Amato with the cross-up using the Mix Mix Mix. Such a fitting name. <laughs> Good stuff from Amato. 2-1, to one, taking the lead. Let's see if you can seal the deal and send Usi Johnny and the losers. <clears throat> Miss Finer, no one home. Let's see how this spins out. Big 6k right there. Forcing Amato to pop the burst. Ah, and the little fast is here to play. Big jump in from Ah uh, Usi Johnny tried to go for the follow up but couldn't quite get anything. It's fine. He's gonna get the wall break. Hmm. We go with the jump in. Oh, again with the spear. Ooh, nice blocks right there. Wow, Johnny, man, this dude should be able to get the kill. Okay, Johnny, not out of this yet. Let's see if he can seal uh, the deal and tie it up. We shall see. Or if Amato is going to. Oh, nice of bar from Mamato checking the uh, the wild assault from Johnny and Johnny with the bag dash. Woo, catching the, the bag dash this time around himself. Ooh. We go to punish. The instant overhead, nice blocks from Mamato. Uh, uh, too far to get the follow up. Again with your bar from Johnny, man. Not afraid and this should do. The overdrive for the kill. Yeah, boom. Okay, Johnny even it up. <laughs> with the tease of the coin. Okay, let's see how this spins out. Is Amato gonna be able to bring it back? Well, actually, this is a perfect tie, so... Oh, Lord! Big start of the round for Amato. Already got rid of the burst of his enemy. Johnny, uh, you see Johnny definitely noticing that Amato likes to... Uh, to dash towards his opponent right after hitting them. In order to either get, like, a command grab or whatnot. Oh lord! No anti right there. And Johnny with uh, the miss fighter for the wall splat and the wall break follow up. Ah. 
The wig is on fire. Ah, uh, no TG. Okay, here we go. The Mato using the burst, the wild, uh, the wild assault in order to secure that heavy knockdown. No oh, Lord. Too far to get the hit. Woo! Blessed be the 3K. Ah, and Amato, man, with the tick pressure. Made it seem like he was gonna go for a command grab, but instead went for the close S. Genius, man. Very nicely done. Let's see what is going to be the major schmixes. Ah, Lord, the empty low for the opening. And Amato gonna get that wall break. Very nicely done. Wow, big for S. Big for um, S, yeah. Amato, uh, man, looking pretty good right now. Ooh, big 3k again with the follow-up trumpet. You have to hold it. And the command grab it had to come eventually. Oh! <laughs> What's the mix? Ah, too far to get the fire. And here we go, the wig is on fire. You have to hold it. Things are looking pretty bleak, not gonna lie. What was that? And Amato seals the deal with the mix, 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 and send Johnny. It's a loser side of the bracket. Ito versus Takari. And you know what? I'm gonna go get a uh, glass of water. I'll be right back, guys. Oh, to toy, come on! A nice jump in right there from it, oh. And here we go with the combos. Eto securing that sweet, sweet wall break. Very nicely done. Uh, choo -choo. One second, guy. Okay. Okay, sorry for the wait. Anyways, here we go with the jump in from it. So gonna get that juggle using the Gamma Blade goes for the instant overhead using the blue Roman cancel. That was sick stuff from it, oh man. Wow, that stare down though. That guy you not afraid, bro. Wow, goes for the wild assault. Ooh! Big bar from it. Oh! And Ito going straight for the overdrive, catching the 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 back AID IID from uh, from Takani manages to seal the deal. First round goes to Eto, man. Eto has come a long way as well. Trust me when I say this. Eto, very very um, old participant of uh, the Broker Cup, probably one of the first as well. He played. He came a little bit later than Takari, than Kohide, than. Uh, even caffeine. Caffeine is probably the, the uh, Takarin is, is the the oldest participant in the in the, uh, in the Wow wake up Axel Bomber are you, are you serious? That was sick good stuff from Takarin, wow. I, I'm I still don't understand the decision making for this, but that was crazy. It worked, so Ah, uh, that was probably a grab attempt, I suppose, from Ito. But she punished by just jumping and doing a a um a Axel Bomber, I suppose. Here we go with Oto Toy, come on! What is going to be the mix-up? We shall see. Big, very nicely uh, guarded right there, blocked by Takarin. That cross-up with. And here we go with the confirms Takarin. Oh, tried to beat that burst. Whew. Big six feet. From it, we're gonna get the corner position. Too far to get the tap though, so you hate to see it. But yes, the follow-up overhead, nevertheless. Ito man, looking on fire, man. Good lord. Go with the forest. Takani has the corner positioning. He's got all of that free real estate. Go for the safe jump. 
Very nice trade for Ito. Should be able that, uh, to get that. Oh, Lord. And Takarim with the closest, man. Relentless. Wow, that punish, though. That was actually a punish. And again, Ito with the instant overhead. Goes straight into the Fujiyama Geisha. For the Ototoy, come on! What is going to be the mix? Big wake up gold burst from Takarim. Oh, gets the closest, man. And again, wow, nice use of the blower man can so and gets the kill with the uh, wall bounce. Takarin puts one on the board. Even evens things out. Very nicely done. And on to the third match. Start of the round. Oh, from it, but drop the combo. Still okay, he has the life advantage, so it's still perfectly fine. Big jump in from Takarin, Takarin with the take, a throw, finds the opening, goes for the safe jump, gets the whiff punish, should be able to get a big, nice wall break. Nice patience from Takarin not to, uh, to grab or do anything whatsoever. Hmm. Let's see how this pans out. Ito with the jump in, gonna get the 2S counter hit. Uses it and immediately cancels into the Alpha Blade to get the side switch. Oh, nice checks right there from Takarin to prevent the... Yeah, to prevent the, uh, the run-ups. Oh, Lord, and that DB has been baited. Wow, full combo, very nicely done by Takarin. Oh, Lord. Ah, nice 6P right there from Ito. Again, drops the, the Alpha Blade. Goes straight for the command grab, though. Gets the grab. It will not over till it's over. Oh, uh, Lord, he goes for the instant over it. For the tap down. Ooh, and he gets the kill. It will not out of this yet, man. It's going back and forth. It's crazy. Down to the next battle. Nice jump in from Takarin. Again, man, it was so on point on these clashes, man. It's been working so good for him. And here we go with the pressure from Takarin, but it's not afraid to press buttons in between, man. Here we go the grab. Oh, again with the BRC. It's been working so good for him, man. Ito, the king of the blue RC, man. Very nicely done. Takes the lead 2 to 1. Is Takarin going to be able to bring it back? We shall see. <laughs> and here we go with the... Ooh, almost got the kill, but unfortunately couldn't seal the deal. This is so unfortunate for Takari. Oh, to try, come on! Not enough to kill. Ooh, big wire see right there. And Ito with the grab for the kill. Here we go. We are on set point. Is Ito going to be able to seal it? Or is Sakai gonna bring it back and be elim and um, eliminated from the from the tournament? Ito with the lead currently goes for the tick pressure. Gets a huge close S counter hit. Ito, come on! One more hit is all that is required. Oh lord, nice whip punish right there from Takarin. Takarin on the verge of getting eliminated. Goes for the grab. Wow, that cheeky grab though. Wow, that was sick. Big 6p counter hit right there for Takarin. For, for Ito manages to take it a quick an extra battle. Asuka versus Jacko. So just give me a couple of seconds, guys.
Okie dokie, Birds and Cookie, and here we uh, go. The precious real Kome Kome forced to ooh, to fight for his life. Unfortunately for him, he does not have. Oh lord, look at the damage. He does not have uh, any any shield anymore in order to protect himself. Bro, this fire is as if you know Japanese things, bro. I've been studying it for quite a while. <laughs> but yeah, I still I still like 100%. I'm not gonna lie. I still have like some very you know that there are some words and or some um, uh, some some sentences or expressions that of course I do not understand yet but I'm working on it eventually I hope that uh, I'll be able to speak it perfectly hopefully and thank you very much for the follow by the way much appreciated that being said here we go and Kome Kome working on the comeback gonna go low and I got a man trying to establish their game and manages to take the kill with the 6p very nicely done. On to the second round. Hey, we we're gonna play some cube. Oh! There's that freaking pressure is overwhelming right there. Kome Kome going up, down, left, right, using cubes, using books. Using everything in the book, with no pun intended. Anyways, we're going with the blue, the electrical cube. Gonna get some real estate space right there. Gonna go for the big cube. Into juggle, into the overhead spear. And Kome Kome, very knowledgeable in the Jackal matchup. Ah, that is unfortunate for him though. Very nicely done. And just like this, we are on the final round of the first match. Who is going to take the first match? We shall see. Oh, definitely. I need to, I need to practice it as hell, man. Well... Good thing that my job is in in Japanese as well, so I basically get everyday everyday practice whether I, I want it or not. <laughs> Since I'm forced to communicate in Japan. Well, obviously I'm in Japan, so yeah, I have to speak the language regardless. But yeah, it's always a good uh I always have plenty of opportunities at job and you know just at offline uh venues where we have like Japanese uh participants of tournaments as well. Yeah, I also have a... Yeah, I definitely need to, to work more on it, though, I feel. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. I'll get there eventually. Thanks for the encouragement, bro. And here we go with the tap dust. Kome Kome forced to top the... To top. <laughs> <laughs> to tap the burst. Not to tap the burst. To pop the burst. Good lord, I'm not... I'm not... I'm I'm really not completely woken up today. Anyways. I get I taken the first match very, very... Well, I'm gonna say pretty convincingly. Not going to lie. Let's see if Kome Kome can find a way to reverse uh, the momentum of battle. We shall see. And on to the second match. <laughs> yeah, I might. I had a slip of the tongue of the tongue right there. Here we go with the air blocks. And Hagiara getting hit by the roots in the corner has to block. What is going to be the mix? We shall see. Uh, there's infinite root blocks right there. Uh, and look at the pressure, man. What are you gonna do? Look at the pressure, man. Poor Hagen has been like freaking blocking for the past 10 minutes. Straight into Super Cube. It's a cube, but it's super. That's the difference. Here we go with Electrical Cube, Explosion, Air Cube, the the quadri quadri Lightning of Death, and on to the next round. Big 5S right there from uh, 5HS, I'm sorry, from Hagala. Unfortunately, he is forced to block already. Electrical cube, air cube, water cube, electric cube, cube, fire cubes, air cube. So many cubes, man. A salad of cubes. A very nice block on the uh, overhead sphere, though, from Hagala. Hagala trying try to fight his way out of the corner, but it's definitely no easy feat. Hagala waking up with the burst, definitely wants some space right there. Oh lord. Ah, uh, big jump in right there on the minion, dispatching him and sending their cube at all at the same time. Very. Oh wow, the freaking confirm on the trade. Hagiara, noticing that it was gonna trade, immediately manages to press kick and then 2D. Very nicely done. Uh, here we go with the Roman cancel. Hagiara really working on that comeback, man. 
And uh, what is it going? To, uh, yeah, you can see Kome Kome. Ah, uh, Kome Kome with the bar. It finds the way out. Very nice blocks. Good lord, how? How? That's exactly that, man. Like, good lord, we're playing Rublox. What, what is it? Ru Rubik's cube? Not Rubik's cube? Rublox. Uh, anyways, we're playing some uh, Minecraft right here, man. So much blocks. So many blocks. And uh, Jacko actually getting a taste of their own medicine in the corner. Which is pretty ironic. Anyways, we're going with Hagiara. Finding the opening. Oh, wow. Look at all them jabs just dispatching all of them Rube blocks. They're, they're Rubik's Cube. They're, they're, they're freaking blocks. That was crazy. Good stuff from Hagiara. Hagiara with the matchup knowledge. definitely It definitely shows. To the forehead. <laughs> exactly. Ah, here we go with the wake up overdrive. I get up finding the answer. Big overdrive right there. Ah, I get up just one second away. Oh, from getting an opening. Working on. Yep. Oh, and this should do straight into the Elysian driver for the kill. I get on set points. Is he gonna be able to make it happen and eliminate Kome Kome from the tournament? We shall see. Big, 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 big aerial earthquake right there from Kome Kome. Gonna get the, uh, the uh, what's it called, the uh, overhead sphere as well. And man, uh, Kome Kome working pretty hard for that, uh, for that, for that comeback. Okay, the pressure of the minion is real. Very nice entire using the jab to be able to keep Kome Kome right in place, right where he wants them. Oh lord, that 2D though. Again, the blocks of Hagara have been immaculate. <laughs> immaculate, like seriously. Oh! Big soccer kick right there from Hagara. And we are in the corner. Oh, Hagara, not enough to kill. Oh, it is though! Oh no! The grabber grab grabbed. That's unfortunate for Aigela. It's not over till it's over though. Just one hit is all that is necessary. Almost got the juggle. Ah, here we go with the super cube. Oh lord! And Aigela getting killed because of it. Kome Kome staying alive still on set point though. It could definitely go either way. It's very nice juggle from Kome Kome. Haven't seen Anago yet this tournament. Haven't been keeping up with the updated either. Is he? He's super strong now. <laughs> I don't know if he's busted. I wouldn't say busted, but now he basically has a um, he has an overhead and a low uh, mix on you because they made it so that the follow up of his DP is overhead, and they made it so that the, that the freaking Beyblade move is a low now. So he basically has a a a free 50 50 right after if you ever block his DP. He can either do like the follow-up, which is an overhead, or do the Beyblade, which is a low. So he has like a free mix-up of free 50-50 on you. On on your on his opponent. So he's pretty freaking I wouldn't say busted, but annoying to fight now. Why would you make Beyblade a low is beyond me, I don't understand. But yeah, uh today's tournament we don't have any Nago, but uh the previous Brojo Cup that we had, which was last week on Monday. Uh, Mugi, who is the uh, the best Dagoriki player in Japan, uh, won the tournament. So yeah, we did have a representation during the last tournament. We did have another Nagoriki player, Cal, whose name is Cal, but um, unfortunately he didn't make it to uh, to the stream, uh, to to a stream match. So yeah, unfortunately we couldn't see him. But we do have some uh, some tournament players, so some uh, some some Mugi, some Nagoriki player. Yeah, then you know, Nagoriki is a. Uh, it's really hit or miss. You can either really like the character or you absolutely hate him. I feel like there's no in, in between, you know. Wow, all of them jabs from Hagara. That was sick. Good stuff from Hagara. Ooh, got hit by the by the um, the wind cube though. Nice use of the overhead sphere though. Gets hit by the explosion for the kill. Komiko working on a comeback, man. This is crazy. Good stuff. See how this fans out. And here we go. One minion sent in the stratosphere. 
coming up. Ah, yeah, I really trying to seal the deal, man. Trying to get this match as quickly as possible. But yeah, Kumiko would just staying very, very patient. Look at that. Very patient. He's been blocking for the past five freaking minutes, man. Oh, Lord, and Kumiko, man, with the recognition station, man. Good Lord. You're welcome. Again, here we go. Damn, Kome Kome on point with the dispatch of the minions, man. It's definitely been working good for him. Goes for the explosion. Big aerial earthquake, but yeah, I get us still just blocking right now. Ooh, this is bad. No, that was a bad burst from Kome Kome. I think that might have been an error, by the way, an input error. And what is gonna be the mix? No schmix, no. Ah! Careful there, YRC, yep. And the minion for the kill. We are on set point. Let's see if I get I can seal the deal. We shall see. And it's corner for you, sir. Kome Kome has been so on point when it came to dispatch the um, the minions, man. He's been really 10 on 10 for the, on this. That being said, look at this, man. The pressure is real. Kome Kome with the super, the super cube. And here we go, the super cube yet again. Wow. I get a one more chance. You absolute Oh, and here we go with the aerial earthquake, man. This has been working pretty good for him. Arena from Daru is going a little bit too high, and I also didn't change his flag. Let me change it right away. And here we go, the beautiful flag of uh, the of South Korea. Okay, on to the next battle. Daruino versus Eto. Let's see if Eto can yet again. Uh, make us dream and contain that that oh lord yeah the pressure is real and to first pop the burst oh lord good stuff from Daru gonna get hit by the wake up DP though from Eto Eto with the Sukiyaki Oh lord! Darino just letting it rip should be able to get the kill with the OTG and does. And on to the next battle. Oh, big stroke right there, right off the bat. Alpha Blade. Oh, nice blocks right there from Eto. Unfortunately, runs straight into an hover and is going to be hit by the overdrive. But it's gonna be the mix. That being said, it has two bars of tension. Have plenty of options of wake up. Ooh! First pop the burst though. Oh lord! Nice stuff from Ito. Just wanted to just wanted to um Oh Lord the Abari though! That Abari! Ah nice. Dari going for the empty low for the kill. First round for Smash goes to Dari no pretty quickly, not going to lie. And here we go. Oh, that tick. Okay, so going for the knockdown. Darren waking up with, with buttons right there. Again, Darren hitting all of them notes, man. Wow, and that stand up jab. That stand up jab call out from it. Oh, that was sick. Enable Ito to get that wall break using the overdrive. And gets the jump in and this should be enough. No, it's not. No, it's not because that super does, do does literally zero damage. So it's going to be the mix up. Jump in. Yep, jump in it is. Ooh, nice block. No! Ito not believing. Ito not believing at all. And Darino going to make the best out of it. Uses one uh, half of a bar burst to secure that hard knockdown. Big freaking Ajitado and Daru Ino clutches it out, steals the first round from Ito, man. Ito who had it on the palm of, in the palm of his hands. It's a one for it for him. 
It will force pop the burst. Nice air to air. I guess the TS counter hit. This is going to be. No! Drops it. Oh, big 6 HS. And the confirm off of it went straight into the overdrive. And rightfully so. Let's see. Ah, close. Oh, Lord! Again with the 6 P. Almost got the juggle, though. Ah, nice checks right there from Ito. Noticing that Daru was going to go for the over. Ah, oh, Lord! Straight into the. Ah. Oh lord, yeah, mix of time. Is this gonna be enough? No, what the hell is going on? And Daru with the with the grab for the kill. What was that last combo? That was sick. And Daru knowing that the last hit would not hit, mix it with and grabs him on the wake up. That was sick. I don't know if it was intentional, but that definitely seemed like it was. Ah, uh, big jumping Z right there from Eto. Gonna go for the wake, uh, for, for the wild assault. Not uh, too far to get the twist to connect. I uh, tried to go for the tap dust, but Dar waking up with buttons yet again. Good damage right there for Darino. Here we go, the tick pressure. Big wild assault, bigs. Close S counter hit. It's oh. Ah, uh, using his burst meter to secure the heavy knockdown. Oh lord! Ooh, what the hell? Ooh! Oh! Very nice reflexes right there from Ito. Resorting to using the, um, the fully charged dust in order to punish Daru. Again, man, with the checks, man. Good stuff from Ito. Gonna go for the empty grab. No Gamma Blade, okay. Ooh, again with the checks, man. Ito, man. Ooh, grab. No grab. Oh, it's fine. Wow, that was sick. <laughs> that were, you know, just big spin every single Gamma Blade. Oh, managed to get the hit. Couldn't quite get the hop, though. Gets hit by the wake up DP from it, though. Again, man, with the stroke counter hit. This is going to do a lot of damage. This is going to do death, actually. And Daru, you know, on set point. Let's see how this ends up. Again with the Jitaro, man. Ooh, Daru with the with the punish right there on the DP. Daru is sticking close to Ito, not giving him any leeway to try to recollect himself. Oof. Big jump in! Wow, and Daru noticing the freaking, the freaking. Let's wake myself up. Oh, be right back. Okay, let's go! So for now, health-wise, Asuka is a little bit down going. But it's still fine, it's just the beginning. Very nice block on the instant overhead, using the misfire. Johnny finally first popped the burst. Here we go with the juggle. Kome Kome should be able to get some pretty nice sit-ups right over there. Let's see Johnny out of arms away. Gonna get the juggle. Almost got the juggle. Here we go with the Miss Finer. Nice blocks right there from Kome Kome forcing. Uh, but finally, you see Johnny forced Kome Kome to pop the burst. Nice backdash. And here we go. One. Wow, and that freaking punish on the take attempt from Usui Johnny. He takes the first round of this first match. Okie dokie, sorry for the wait. 
big confirm right there from Johnny Gun again. Does he wall break? Nice jump in, Ma. This is so cheeky. Almost got it, but unfortunately, Komi Komi already had committed to the burst, but it's still fine. We we'll see Johnny getting the kill. Takes the first match. Let's see how Komi Komi is going to answer. We shall see. As expected, yeah, the Miss Finer is definitely posing a problem. It's a little bit the same. It's probably one of the uh, other reasons for why uh, I, I, I believe that Eno um, has a favorable matchup when it comes to fighting Asuka's is because she has the um, chemical love which goes through the cube and hits Asuka directly. And I think it's basically the same principle with, with uh, Johnny who has the Miss Finer which goes through the cubes and hits, um, hits Asuka directly, I guess. Yesterday was a 12 versus 12 invitational between Team G, uh, yeah, Jig and uh, Team uh, Ibushi game. Won by Jig after Mochi last defeated. That is crazy, yeah. This week is a go home tourney before Arc Revel Japan and CLT. Yeah, yeah, man. Everybody getting hyped. Everybody, man. That is crazy, man. I am definitely looking forward to. Uh, Arc Revel is going to be lit, man. There's going to be so many people. There's so many participants already. Uh, and it's gonna be in the new venue too. It's uh, close to the Tokyo Tower, I believe. Tokyo, yeah, the Tokyo Tower. It's it's right next to it. It's actually inside of it, I think. And uh, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to it. Anyway, there we go with the Miss Finer for the kill. Good stuff from Usui Johnny. Usui Johnny looking pretty good now. Actually, yeah, having a. Not that much of a hard time, even though his opponent is none other than one of the best Asuka players in the band. Mm. Top 8 of Arc Revo is held at TGS, yeah. At Tokyo Game... Oh yeah, the top 8, but the, the qualifiers, not the qualifiers, the... Um, the, the I'm gonna say the brackets, the, the pools, are held at Tokyo uh, Tokyo Tower. But yeah, the, uh, the top 8 will be at Tokyo Game Show, yeah. You're right. Indeed you are. But yeah, I was referring to the uh, the pulls. Well, the, the, yeah, it's the pulls, I guess we can say. Yeah. Anyways, here we go on with the follow up. Nice bluffs on the Miss Finder. Big 6P right there from Komi Komi. Should be able to seal it. And on to the next battle. See so Johnny looking pretty good, but Komi Komi bringing the adjustments. Oh, the big air to air counter it. There's been a lot of them. It's very nice bait on the burst right there from Usui Johnny. Let's see how this spins out. And here we go with the with the overdrive for the hard knockdown. Orino no. There's gonna be the mix. Ah. Oh. I thought he was gonna go for the double overhead. Nice grab right there from Musi Johnny, man. Taking a pretty significant lead, not going to lie. What is Komi Komi gonna do? What is Komi Komi gonna do? Let's see. Very nice 6P again. <laughs> and here we go with uh, the whiff punish. That being said, Komi Komi not afraid to just run straight to towards their opponent, pressing buttons. Okay, trade in favor of Komi Komi using the Roman cancel in order to punish his opponent. We go to the safe jump, empty jump actually. Ah oh, lord, and the maximum, maximum cubes have been thrown out. Komi Komi looking more alive now. Will you be able to bring it back? And it's Cube Town. Nice air to air from Komi Komi. Forcing Johnny to pop the burst. Woo! Big overhead sphere right there. Komi Komi with the grab. And Komi Komi with the super cube. Here we go with the corner, pressure, and Komi Komi finally putting one on the board. Definitely not out of this yet. 
So, what is Usui Johnny gonna do right now? Kumi Kumi definitely seems to have found the necessary adjustments. Very good 6P, forcing Johnny to pop the burst. Again with the aerial earthquake. Gonna get the juggle. Kumi Kumi changing decks right now. Benefiting from the explosion. Good stuff from Kome Kome. Gonna get the wall break with the super cube. Not enough to kill. Not by oh, a long shot, by, by the way. And here we go with the tab dust, man. And that should be it for this round. Kome Kome on the verge of tying it up. Will he be able to? Usui Johnny looking a little bit impatient now, trying to close the gap. Got hit by the overhead sphere. Nice with punish. Here we go with the Miss Finer and get the knockdown. And Kome Kome just content to, to just block and not overextend. Got hit by the Hob though. Straight into the overdrive. Good stuff. Nice confirm, and he got the kill with the overdrive. Okay, we see Johnny on set point. We go with the explosion. Kome Kome is in. Ah. Again with the explosion. Here we go. Kome Kome with the spear. The spear with the overhead sphere. Nice blocks from Usi Johnny though. I'll find the opening with the 2D though. The Miss Finer, very nice entire. Oof! How did he block that? <laughs> Kome Kome on point with the blocks, bro. Damn. A good spear. Ah ah ah. Kome Kome almost out of mana. He needs to be careful. If he gets open once, it's over. Well, he does have burst though, but. Okay. Kome Kome looking pretty good now. Ah, uh, big super cube right at the start of the match, and just like this, man, just like this, Kome Kome bring it back. What is happening? Who's gonna see the deal? We shall see. Okay, Johnny with the side switch. A little bit too far to get the yeah. To get the cord slash. Big tap dust right there from Kome Kome, forcing to see Johnny to pop the burst. Blue cube catching the back dash. Well, not cube, square. See Johnny definitely having a problem trying to pin Kome Kome down. Nice with punish. The blocks of Usi Johnny have been pristine, man. I've eaten every single overhead sphere that that Kome Kome sent uh, to Ugrisa Johnny. Johnny. Uh, Ugrisa Johnny. Johnny. Usi Johnny. Ugrisa Johnny. Did that. <laughs> we'll see Johnny, we'll see Johnny. Okay, man, just like this, man. Kome Kome on the reverse 3 0 right there. One more round. This is set point. Is Kome Kome gonna be able to seal the deal? B 
big stare down right there. Oh, a little bit too far to get the overdrive. Oh, the pressure is real. We see Johnny having to eat everything and their mother. Good lord. Ah, we see Johnny. No, not out of it yet. Big 6P. I'll get to see Johnny out of it. Finally. Out of the corner. So, went for the instant overhead, but no one was so. Woo! Goes for the freaking take punish. And just like this, we're going on to the final round of the final match. The one who takes this, takes it all. I have no idea how to block that. I, I have no idea. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh, and it's back to zoning time. Big explosion right there from Komi Komi. Who is going to take it? Big super cube right there. Komi Komi looking pretty good. Gonna have the hard knockdown. Inciting we see Johnny to pop the to pop the uh, the reverse shield. Unfortunately for us, oh, it's not over. Yeah, but that's pretty much that's pretty much checkmate. Wow, here we go. The Misfire who catches the back dash. Not over till it's over. Ooh, the big punish goes for the wild assault to secure the hard knockdown. That is going down to the wire. Who's gonna take it? Oh, Lord of the Ground! Oh no, he could have gotten the kill with the OTG! He could have gotten the kill with the OTG! No! Why? It's so tired. <laughs> it's crazy. But it's fine, it's fine. I, the matches are keeping me awake, so that, that's actually pretty cool. So let's see, next matchup. This is the winner. Huh? Wait. Just a minute. Eh? Yeah. Can my final one? Ah, my, yeah. Okay, well, apparently, apparently Darwino, uh, <laughs> Okay, just one second. Yeah, Jari said, "Hell, I, I don't have time for this. <laughs> I need to play right now." <laughs> anyway, let me let me uh, just update their names. I was like, "What? Kathleen doesn't play doesn't play Eno." <laughs> Well, anyways, yeah, let's just do this. It's fine, it's fine. So this is the loser semi-final, by the way. Right, let me just update the flags real quick. Uh, and this is the loser semi-final, yeah. Loser... Semi... Uh, semi-final, here we go. Sorry for the wait. Okay, we're all good now. Yeah, I was surprised. Uh, <laughs> Okay, good to go. So, uh, so far so good. Darino takes uh, the first match. Pretty convincingly, not gonna lie. That being said, this matchup is probably most definitely in, in favor of Eno. Well, in my honest opinion. <laughs> so let's see how this pans out. Second round, is Kome Kome gonna be able to seal the deal? Or bring it back? Very nice 2D right there. Catches Daru off guard. Gets the knockdown as well. Very nice use of the wild assault to keep the pressure ongoing. And the mixes are real. Ah, Kome Kome doesn't have a shield anymore. This is pretty bad for him. Of course, pop the burst if he didn't want to lose all of his life at once. Big stroke right there with Kome Kome trying to read the agitado, but actually. Dar using the stroke and going underneath the 6 speed that Kome Kome had ready to punish it. And he's gonna go with the lows. Dar, you know, with the wall break. 
That was a pretty good set, y'all. That was sick. And on with the good mixes from Dari. Very nice experience there from Kome Kome. Punishing the Agitado. And here we go with the wall break. Darino on a freaking. On a freaking. How do you call it? A speed run. Good lord. Dino doesn't have any chill, man. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. I got a winner's final to go to. Whoa. Not a winner's final. I have a grand final to go to, man. Anyways, good stuff from Daru Ino. Taking the lead 2 0. Let's see how this spins out. Is Kome Kome gonna be able to bring it back? It's definitely not impossible, but. A little bit on. Um, oh, Lord. Okay. Yeah, nice six spear there from Kome Kome. Unfortunately, no one was home. And Arino just like this on set point. We go with the side switch. Big overhead sphere right there from Kome Kome. Kome Kome with the grab. Gonna get the wall break with the super cube. Boom. Nice back dash from Darino out of harm's way. Gonna go for the re-jump. And all sorts of mixes using the wild assault to prevent his opponent from being able to burst. Oh lord, I thought he was gonna go for the Megalo. The Megalo. Megalomania, not enough to kill, but very close. One more hit is all that is required for Darino to seal the deal. Wow, and here we go. Ooh, not enough to kill. Thank you, Shield. Wow! Uh oh, 6 feet, yeah. Ah, nice, dude. Ooh, here we go, the Golden Burst. Wow. Ooh, and here we go, the tap this for the kill. You want an overhead? I have an overhead as well. Good stuff from Kome Kome. Stays alive. Nice juggle. Is he going to be able to get the wall break? Yes, he is. Here we go, the jump in. Ooh, Daru getting scooped by the explosion. Big 6P from Kome Kome, gonna get the counter hit and the corner. Oh, and here you go with the overhead. This should do. And it's enough for the KO. Kome Kome staying alive, puts one on the board. Okay, here we go with the note. Oh lord. And Arena with the wall break using the overdrive. What's the mix? Plain old jumping HS. Good stuff from Daru. Gets the kill. And on to the set point. Is Kome Kome gonna be able to save it again? A nice punish. Gonna get the grab. Ooh, big wild assault right there from Kome Kome. Keeps the corner positioning. Gonna go straight for the super cube. Wow. Good stuff from Kome Kome. Being alive yet again. Saves this uh, set point yet again. Wow, the checks are real, man. Kome Kome does not want to... Ooh, lit up. Here we go with the delay jumping D, man. The bane of a lot of players. Let's see how this spins up. Here we go with the super cube. Hits his mark. Good stuff with the explosion, man. Definitely catching Darino of guard. Ooh, Lord. 
and again and with the sip. No! No, not like this. No! Call me, call me, you had it. You had it. Oh, Lord. Good look. Oh, no! Oh, no, call me, call me, not like this. Why? Why? Call me? I think I might have gotten hit by it too. I think it's because he was probably, um, he was probably stressed out and there was so much shit going on in the screen that he didn't really realize what's happening and then, oh, when he realized, was like, no, why did I press a button there? I'm sure he, he, he felt it, he felt like this. That being said, we're going on to the winner's final. Let's see who is, uh, yeah, and Caffeine is not from South Korea, by the way. Here we go. So let's see how this is going to pan out. Good lord. Ah, big diver there from Mamato on Cafe. Nice water see from Mamato. Ooh! Okay, Mamato managed to secure the trumpet. The cavalry. Unfortunately, got scooped by his own by his own weight. Woo! Nice UHS. Very nicely done by Cafe. Lord, wow! Using the to the freaking shield from the minion. Ah, oh, that was sick. Nice juggle right there from Cafe. Oh, wow, I'm about to first pop the burst. Woo! Very nice use of the shield right there from Cafe. Cafe looking very good today. Holy freaking Lord. Gonna go. Oh no! He didn't go for the for the overdrive. Ooh, wow. Still got screwed by the 2S. The 2K. The 2P, I'm sorry. Okay, nice a bar from Caffeine. Oh, that went for the BRC. That was sick. We tried to go for the grab, but Amato aware of it and just backdash very, very smoothly. Here we go with the wake up a bar from Caffeine. Definitely looking free. Ah, Lord, Amato, gonna get the wall break. No, he's not. Ooh, but went with a pretty nice tap dust for the kill. Good stuff. And on to the next battle. Go to mix, 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 but no one's home. Again, nice use of the guard point, man. It's been working so good for him. However, Caffeine forced to pop the burst. Oh, Lord. Amato with the trumpet. Well, I guess the air to air, gonna get the juggle. Oh, went for the freaking mix ups right there, unfortunately for him. Uh, Caffeine managed to block it correctly. Very nice use of the command rush. Yay, Leo Faust to Genki Deska. Genki Deska, Leo san. <laughs> and just like this, Amato, man, puts one on the board, brings it back. 1 to 0. Let's see how this pans out. Is he gonna be able to send Caffeine in the loser's bracket? We shall see. Nice grab from Caffeine. And Caffeine with the corner pressure, man. Gonna go for the grab. Oh, Lord. Here we go with the wall break with the wild assault. Wow. Big standing HS for the perfect. Caffeine definitely not out of this yet at all. <sighs> Big fire of the chest yet again. <laughs> Amato san having a lot of uh, supporters in the chat. It's very nice to see. Amato, very strong Faust player. Extremely strong one. Let's see how this pans out. Ah, here we go with the mix. Nice box from Caffeine. Almost got <laughs> command grab there. Caffeine having some issues trying to really... To really uh, force Amato to play his game. Big syringe for the kill. Again, Amato on the verge of taking this second match, man. Here we go with the command grab. Amato, man. This con content to, like, keep Caffeine in the corner, throwing as much item as possible at him. It's hammer time. Caffeine finally forced to pop the burst. Ooh, 
Nice job, little from caffeine. Gonna get a lot of mileage off of this. Not enough to kill by any means, but definitely close to it. That being said, Amato does have a burst. And Caffeine going straight for the tap dust for the kill. Good stuff. Caffeine putting one on the board. We have a tie, ladies and gents. And on to the next battle. Okay, here we go, the corner pressure. One that Caffeine definitely excels at. Gonna get the closest for the counter hit and gonna get the kill. So next up, let's see how this spins out. Okay, Amato getting counter hitted right there. Unfortunately for him, nice juggle from Caffeine. Should be able to get the heavy knockdown with the wild assault. Wow. Caffeine catching Amato, ba backing up one too many times. Got scooped by the 2D for a perfect. That went uh, very quick. What is Amato going to do? What adjustment is he going to be forced to bring in order to shift the tide of battle? And on to the next battle. Nice block on the burst. That was really good. Wow. Nice 6 right there from Caffeine. Gonna, oh, tried to go for uh, empty something, but got scooped by Amato instead. This should be a nice wall break. Good stuff from Caffeine. Ooh, gonna catch that back there. Oh lord, and the tick throw, not the tick throw, the, the guard point, man. Oh, and here we go with the grab again. Not the grab, with the burst punish again. Okay, a caffeine on set point. Is he going to be able to secure his way to the grand final? We shall see. Nice grab from caffeine. Oh, going to go for the uh, fake cross up, man. Oh lord. The big spear. And here we go with the mix, mix, mix. Ah, uh, Caffeine force pop the YRC. Goes for the grab for the side switch. Here's a look at oh, again, man. Amato again. Getting baited. Getting his burst baited yet again by Caffeine. That was a clean 3 to 1 by Caffeine. Uh, Leo telling Amato basically to stop drinking. <laughs> stop drinking, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord anyways let's see how this pans out uh so this is the loser's final the one who wins this one will get a shock a, a shot a shot back uh against caffeine so let's see how this pans out so mato not too fun of the eno matchup oh lord nice trade that was fortunate for amato wow that was sick that was a bit crazy a okay, nice dive right there from Amato. Okay, here we go with the side switch. Very nicely done by Amato. Gonna get a full combo. And go for the wild assault. Wow, nice 6 speed right there from, from Darino. Darino gonna get the cavalry. Gonna keep Amato in the corner. Amato with the 2S, man. Definitely worked in his favor. Nice punish right there from Dar. Wow, got the juggle too. That was sick. And this should be it. Yeah. Oh Lord, try to go for the grab, but Amato, aware of it. Ah, enough to kill. Yes, it is. Amato. Wow. Getting on to the second match, the second round. Big six spear right there from Dar. No? Forcing Amato to wake up with uh, the first. Okay, little Faust is in the house. 
Ah, nice little fire's gonna play. Oh, but little fire's messed up, mi messed things up. <laughs> oh, Lord, that's so unfortunate. Nice call out right there from Amato to catch the Agitato. <laughs> I keep making rhymes. Nice stuff from from Amato to call out the Agitato, I think. Was, oh, Lord! And another call out right there from Amato with the overdrive. Very nicely done. Uh, gonna try to bait stuff, but... Oh no, the stroke is real. Oh lord, and the spear, and it's enough to kill an Amato. Actually, it takes the first round, yo. Are we gonna get another upset? Damn, that would be sick, yo. I love this song, by the way. Any fans of uh, Zelda, uh, The Wind Waker? I absolutely love the Zelda. Such a good Zelda. So underrated. For Japanese. Ah, uh, what you mean? Ah, Suiken, ka. Yeah, na. Suiken desu ne. Hold on, eh. Drunken fist. So, basically, um, what uh, Leo Faust is saying is that Amato is, is currently playing the drunken fist. That's why he's winning. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. I freaking loved Wind Waker. It wasn't my favorite though. My favorite was and still is Ocarina of Time. Oh, I do like uh, I do like a link to the past as well though. I really like it as well. But I think my favorite is Ocarina of Time just for the for the yeah the hype factor. I played it uh, like on release date. It was like ah, oh, it blew my my mind away. This game did. And then it's probably Wind Waker, I guess. But uh, I do like Breath of the Wild as well. It's not my favorite Zelda though, but because it, it's open worldish, Skyrimish, you know. But uh, I, I really like the game, though. It's a very, very good game. Breath of the Wild, that is. But The Wind Waker, man, such a good game, man. I really, absolutely love this game. I love the art style as well. That being said, look at this, man. Amato staying alive, yo. Damn. Ah, uh, The Wind Waker, man. What I really like about The Wind Waker too is the music. The music's are. Freaking awesome. Oh, it did, man. That The cell shading is, is a technique that goes... Like, that lasts for ages and ages. Like, it's, it's something that you can replay and... The graphics won't be, like, uh, uh, an issue at all. Because it's so... You can adapt it to so many, like, different mediums. And it's just so good. Anyways, here we go with... Daru putting one on the board. Not letting Amato get him away for free. Yeah, Wind Waker was was really good. I love this freaking Zelda. But yeah, my favorite is still Ocarina of Time, though. I would love that they do, like, a remake of Ocarina of Time, but I feel like it's never gonna happen. And I don't see why it would happen anyways, but... But yeah, man. Or, no! Something I'd like to see is... I don't know if you guys know... Well, you probably know. But, uh, the... the so, Zelda Link's Awakening, they made, like, a remake of Link's Awakening with a very, very interesting art style. I just, I just wish they would do the same for A Link to the Past. They do a remake with the art style that they use for A Link's Awakening. That would be so good. That would be so uh, so awesome. I really hope they'll do it eventually. Absolutely love how they do it. Yeah, the yeah the 3DS was okay, but I, I I wish for a better, you know, a more polished remake, I suppose, with really very new next gen graphics and whatnot, you know. This I'd love, I'd love so much, but I would first want to have like a remake of um, of uh, a link's hmm? of uh, a link to the past, but with the art style of the remake that they use for Link's Awakening. I would be so happy if they made one, and I feel like it would be normal that they would do it too. But there's been so many remakes of um, of uh, a link to the past that I feel like it's probably not gonna happen. But if they did, that would be so awesome. I'd buy it like day one. They could have my money right away, no problem. <laughs> Anyways, nice call out again from Amato, man. Getting them juggles in the corner carry. Oof, big six. Oh, Lord, and the bait has been... Yeah, the burst has been bait. Oh! <laughs> that was strange. I don't know if it's the, the bomb... If it's the... Um, I don't know if it's the Fortissimo which killed Amato or if it was the the bomb... Uh, the, the bomb radius from... Uh, from the bomb of Amato that killed himself. I have no idea. But that was pretty funny. 
And here's here we go with Ah oh, Lord Darino getting yeah Darino releasing the next gate yeah, getting really really warmed up for his upcoming match if things go well with uh against Amato. Yeah, Darino did not appreciate the fact that he was sent to the losers. Damn, that was quick. Perfect from Darino, man. On the verge of eliminating Amato. Big counter hit right there, man. Denying the, the burst uh, options to Amato as well. Let's see how this pans out. Wow! Ah, that being said, Daru did end up uh, cornering himself. Big 6P, man. Here we go with the juggle. Oh, the Megalo, man! Daru Eno. Where's the no Megalo? Where's your no Megalo, Daru? <laughs> Good stuff from Daru Eno, though. Okay, and on we go. This is the grand final last match of today, ladies and gentlemen. Today's tournament was actually pretty hype, I'm not gonna lie. Lots of upsets, lots of, uh, yeah, lots of, uh, lots of surprising results, if I might say. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be the run back for Daru, who got sent to the loser's bracket by Caffeine. So let's see what he has in store this time around to try to adapt and secure the win this time around. We shall see. Wow, and again, man, Caffeine with the call out on the freaking burst. Yeah, Caffeine has been on point with that, man. Good lord, but that being said, look at this. Ooh, nice blocks, and here we go with Caffeine popping the illusion driver for the kill. Caffeine playing out of his mind. Caffeine definitely have, has drank a lot of coffee today. This is the least we can say, yeah. Wow, he even got the 2D good stuff. Oh, big 2D counter it. Oh, didn't get the struggle though. This is unfortunate. And here we go with DMT low. Straight into the wild assault. Oh, no, no, too far for the 2HS. You hate to see it happen. This should be death, yeah. Good stuff from Dawes. That's still not over till it's over. First match is going to be extremely important for the morale. Let's see how this spins out. Wow, and Daru paying extra attention to the tick throw. Oh no, you hate to see it. Daru's uh, execution was inverted because Caffeine uh, basically um, crossed under him and switched and uh, like it made his input like the opposite way. And instead of doing a dive, he ended up doing a uh, chemical love, which is definitely not what he wanted to do. And he said, look at this, man. Oh, nice grab from Daru. Daru Eno. Ah, what is the mix? Nice. This is death right there. First match goes to Daru Eno. Definitely eager to win this tournament. Let's see how this pans out. This is the boss battle indeed. Ah, big jump in right there from Darino. Oh, getting really good with Caffeine, getting the juggle. Darino's still holding on to their burst. Goes for the grab again. Very nicely done. And this should do. Caffeine with the forever Elysian driver. Enough to kill. Good stuff. Good stuff from Caffeine. Here we go with ooh the jump it wow good stuff from caffeine no juggle unfortunately wow <laughs> it stays active for so long tried to go for the soccer kick but Darino was a little bit too far to for it to connect unfortunately for him the double D here we go oh lord and wake up overdrive Darino said I've had it I'm going to mix you. Oh lord! Oh no, with the follow-up! And this is death. You're dead. Nice comeback from Daru, man. Showing his proficiency with Eno. Oh, big 5 HS counter hit. Gets the juggle, tries to go for the 2S. Here we go with the grab. Daru Eno definitely susceptible to grabs. Again with the grab. 
and again, man, with uh, the cap does. This has been the bane of Daru. Not enough to kill. We might have a wake up golden burst from uh, from Daru or not. Oh Lord! And using the double wild assault to prevent Daru from from using his uh, his burst. That was crazy good. Good stuff from uh, from caffeine puts onto the board. Good stuff, man. And here we go with the burst. Whew. Okay, nice blocks right there. I got unfortunately jumped on. Caffeine looking pretty good, but right now, well, not so good actually. Yeah. Uh, definitely getting uh, damaged a lot. What's gonna be the mix? Wow, nice standing AS, close S for the entire, and this should be dead. Okay, Darino up to the. Uh, well, up one round. Just needs one more to take the lead. Ooh, big jumping D right there. Very nice use of D. Uh, the what's it called um, that, the um, guard point. Okay, ooh, big counter hit right there, and nice juggle from Caffeine. Gonna get a corner carry or not? Tried to go for a grab again. <laughs> Nice use of the minion. Ooh, nice uh, juggle into the Elysian Driver. Not enough to kill. Driver! Not even gonna wall break out. Oh no! Oh, but it actually worked out in his favor. Nice grab. Are you serious? That was sick. Ooh. Darino being a lot more violent now. He has chosen violence. Okay, not in uh, no burst gauge in order to secure the heavy knockdown. Oh lord, yeah. Yeah, you can see Caffeine trying to find a way to yeah, shift the momentum. This is looking pretty pretty bleak. Good stuff for Darino puts another one on the board. Okay, okay, it's not over till it's over. Caffeine does have another chance, another opportunity. Even if he loses this set, he was he will still have another chance to try and uh, and bring it back. So it's definitely not over yet. And look at that, we have three minions on deck. Darino popping the burst. Nice with punish right there from Caffeine. Oh lord! Wow, big wild assault right there, straight into the Roman cancel for the juggle. Nice stroke to go under the 5HS. Nice blocks on the int. Oh lord, yeah, this one is very hard to block. And here we go with the wild assaults. Darino wants to secure this heavy knockdown. And here we go with the URC. Nice stick pressure and. Cafe not out of this yet. A uh, big jump in right there from Darino with the jumping HS. Gonna get the wall break. We go with the 2k. Nice blocks from Caffeine, but got hit by the follow up. Uh, again with the. Yeah, with the schmix. Darry taking it with the perfect. This is a set point. Reset point, actually. Nice shimmy, here we go, Caffeine, back to shimmy again. <laughs> oh, the duty! Jacko doesn't care about the reflex shield. She definitely does not. How did the 5HS not hit Daru there? I do not understand. But... Ah, big, big, big wall splat right there. Ah, and unfortunately got baited. Big fire which is gonna get the conversion station. Ah. And here we go with caffeine out of minions. Ah. Or maybe not. Oh, it still got scooped by the tab dust. Wow, yo, caffeine on the verge of taking it, yo. If caffeine takes the following match, he wins the tournament. No second chance for Daru. So Daru absolutely needs this one if he wants to stay. Well, if he wants to uh, stay alive and continue his road towards winning the tourney. Big dive right there. 
caffeine got open. Ooh, drop of the combo right there. Ooh. Big, big six feet. Uh, six feet. Yeah, six feet. We go with the wild assault into the fortissimo for the wall break. Oh. Ah, big dive. He got adequately punished. Try to go for the shimmy again. Big five. HS, nice well the salt. I thought I thought Daru was gonna wake up with the. Uh, whoa, 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 what's going on? Ooh, big chemical love, and the two HS for the kill. Daru on reset point. Let's see if he manages to seal the deal. Wow, big two HS counter. This did a ton of damage. And here we go with the wall break. Daru smelling blood. Goes for the re-jump. Oh no, couldn't quite get anything, but it's okay. And reset it is into the Megalomania. The reset has been a Daru, man. But Caffeine is definitely doing pretty good, man. He had he lost two to three the, the the previous set, which is definitely definitely good. I mean he eliminated Daru during their previous set, like when they were back in the, the winner's bracket. And still managed, like in grand finals, to well, it, it was crazy to two, but it really could have went either way. So yeah, no, Caffeine doing a very good job, extremely good job. Yeah, he definitely improved. And here we go with the damage, and you die. Dowry looking unstoppable, man. Holy freaking lord! Oh, again, here we go with a uh, V wall break. Caffeine looking a little bit lost, not going to lie. Ooh, that was an unfortunate, uh, an unfortunate um, shield. And here we go, the Fortissimo for the kill. Very quick for his game right there from Darino. <clears throat> the Reflect Shield. Okay, let's see how this pans out. Daru staying just right out of range, right at a range where uh, he can actually hit Caffeine with the Chemical Love. Extremely annoying range for Jackal players, I suppose. But very nice blocks from Caffeine, man. The one, uh, one minion was out, unfortunately. The roaming cancel slowed down time and Daru was able to confirm into a uh, hit to Punish the back dash again with the Twitch hit, bro. Oh, big tap dust right there. Nice blocks from Dao Ronaldo for Tobari. Goes for the grab for the kill. Now to the next battle. Big 5 HS coming hit. Definitely needs to make something start going, get the momentum back. That was nice, and here we go with the grab. Straight into the illusion, driver for the kill. Driver! Good stuff from Caffeine with the perfect, very strong statement right there. And just like this, man, Daru on the verge of on the verge of taking the tournament yet again. Oh, 
get in, Kathy. Trying as hard as possible to bring, bring it, bring the comeback. Ooh, went for a pretty interesting cross-up. Uh, nice blocks on the dive, though. And here we go with the Akuma Fireball, trying to seal the deal with the minion. Okay, still not out of this yet. We all believe. Come on, Caffeine. Reverse 3 0 now. And here we go with. Ah, uh, that was an unfortunate. Nice jump in. Caffeine with the OTG. Catching the back dash with the minions. Oh, using the stroke to go underneath. Nice six period there from Daru, though didn't hit home. Ooh, wake up for TC most floors. The reflex shield definitely posing some problems to Daru. Daru trying to make his way and get scooped by the minions. Cafe not out of this yet. Definitely does not want to give up this chance. Let's see if he can make it happen. We shall see. Definitely found something there. Nice 2k right there from Cafe. Oh, big dive right there from Daru. Nice blocks from Cafe. And unfortunately, got hit by the follow up. And here we go with a B4 TC mode. Nice empty lord right there from Daru. Is that gonna be enough? Yeah, it's gonna be enough. Tournament point for Daru. If Daru wins this one, he wins the whole tourney. Let's see how this turns out. Nice 6p from Daru. Mm. And here we go with the tick pressure. Big 6p from Daru. We go for the re-jump. Gotta get the wall. The, not the wall though. Oh, and the megalomania, man. Oh, Lord. You hit getting hit, hit by this, man. Ton of damage right there. What is gonna be the Okizeme? Lord! Daru definitely feeling himself going for the low and getting the kill! Daru with the 3 to 1! Bracket 